on the sports network here, and um, a lot of shit happened. Um, Mari Cooper got traded to the Cowboys, and um, my boy Chad Kelly, fucking dumbass. He got arrested for trespassing. He was probably on drugs as a fucking cowboy getting scared by a vacuum. Um, he's probably gonna go to the CFL with Johnny Manziel. He's gonna join Johnny Manziel in the CFL. Um, anyway, let's get to the predictions. Dolphins and Texans. I'm picking the Texans to win. Brock Osweiler's facing his former team. <laughs> oh my god, Brock Osweiler. That ah, man. I'm picking the Texans to win at home. Eagles and Jaguars. Holy shit. Both these teams underperformed like fuck this year. I'm picking the Eagles to win. I don't know why. I think it's not going to do anything for the franchise. If if one of these teams lose, they're basically out of the postseason. And if the Jags lose, you know, the Jags were hyped up to be one of the top teams in the AFC. They started off hot and they went downhill. <laughs> Ravens and Panthers. I'm picking the Panthers. The Panthers are red hot, man. I think coming back from a 17 nothing deficit versus the Eagles, I think, um, is good. And the Ravens, they missed the extra point versus the uh, the Saints. And uh, I think I'm picking the Panthers to win at home. I'm picking the Bears to win at home. You know, despite allowing... A kick return touchdown and a block punt touchdown. I think the Bears played decent against New England. New England, you know. Um, but I think they're going to win and redeem themselves and get back in that winning column. Buccaneers, Bengals. Actually, I, I think this can go either way, but I'm picking the Buccaneers to win. Because I want spoiler. Famous Jameis is going to do his shit. <laughs> And beat the bungles into the bungling of the bungle bungle. Um, Seahawks and Lions. Lions beat the jet. Um, beat the Jets, and I think the Seahawks were on a bye week. I don't know. Um, I'm picking the Lions to win at home versus the Seahawks. Yeah. Um, Broncos Chiefs. I'm picking the Broncos to win. This is gonna backfire, but um, this can go either way. I think, you know, the only team that contested the Chiefs all year was the Broncos. Broncos, they have allowed the least amount of points against the Chiefs. And I think they're going to allow the least, still the least amount of points coming out of this game. Coming out of this game. Because if this, this is going to be a shootout, I believe, because Mahomes is talented. we got talented players like Tyreek Hill and um, Tyreek Hill and Kareem Hunt. And Sammy Watkins, so I think um I think the Broncos can win this game, but they all can also lose this game. It can go either way, but uh, it's a rivalry game. But I'm picking my Broncos to win. Redskins and Giants. The Giants are just fucking trash, man. And the Redskins are um I think they can win. They're gonna win on the road and uh they have the Bear team and uh old man Pearson's gonna be uh Man, Pearson's gonna be trucking. Yeah, fucking cut again. I hate when it cuts. Steelers and Brown, I'm picking the Steelers to win. Man. Browns, you know, at least they gotta win two wins this year. That's a fucking accomplishment, man. That's better than their last four seasons, man? No, two seasons. Wow. Um, I'm picking the Steelers to win at home, and I they're probably gonna lose. <laughs> Uh, Stellars. Um, Colts and Raiders. I'm picking the Colts to win on the road. I think Andrew Luck is... He's second in touchdowns to Patty Mahomes. Patrick Mahomes. And the Raiders are just fucking gutting their team to smithereens. So I'm picking the Colts to win. Niners and Cardinals. I'm picking the Cardinals because at least they have a fucking quarterback at the moment. Jimmy G, he gone. Jimmy G gone. He gone. He fucking gone. He gone. And uh, I think the Cardinals are going to get their second win of the year. And the Niners are going to have a shittier record. Packers and Rams. Packers and Rams. Um, 
Uh, I think the the Rams are gonna stay undefeated. I think they have a god squad of a team. Brandon Cooks, um, Jared Goff, especially Todd Gurley, Aaron Donald leading the league in sacks. They have a beast of a squad. Um, I think they're gonna beat the Packers. But this, I think these, like these two games right here, are gonna be set up for like big, big good games. Um. It's two games. I'm picking the Saints and I'm picking the Patriots to win those games. Both road teams. All right, I'll start with the Saints and the uh, Vikings. Um, I think the Saints, the Saints are gonna win. Uh, Drew Brees hasn't thrown a pick yet. You know they got lucky because they are the Saints. Who that going to beat them Saints? <laughs> um, I think the Saints are gonna win this one. I think they have a good firepower in Drew Brees. Drew Brees is. He's something, man. And uh, I admire him break Payne Manning's touchdown record than Tom Brady. Um, I think um, I think the Saints are going to win that game. Patriots and Bills. I'm picking the Patriots, man. Man, who does the Bills got? Derek Anderson. Nathan Peterman. <laughs> Old man LaShawn McCoy. I think the Patriots have a better team. You know, they drafted Welsh. Uh, Michelle, he's a good running back. Good rookie. Um, um, yeah, those are my picks for the game uh, on Sunday and Thursday and Monday. And, uh, yeah, baby, let's go.